She was an empress. Me growing up, I'm going to draw you back to the Olympics. I can't remember the year. The javelin. Oi, 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 Tessa Sanderson, stand up yeah. and salute. You understand? Because I remember it was all about Fatima Whitbread. Whitbread. Yeah, man, yeah, man. It was yeah, all man. about Fatima Whitbread. England's hopes on Fatima Whitbread. You know, our, 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 our only mental hope in the women's javelin is Fatima Whitbread, you know. Fatima Whitbread, you know. They forgot about Tessa Sanderson, who's been here how many years long before. Fatima Whitbread, yeah, man. but Fatima came in and let's be real, Fatima was built like a Russian back in them days when you look at it now, yeah, yeah, she was built like a Russian and it says, and I say this for saying that, Tessa Sanderson was a big girl still, don't get it twisted, I want to say Whitbread, she was Russian, she was like tick but solid tick, yeah, 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 yeah. whereas Tessa Sanderson was Cory got on rice tick. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you get what I'm saying? It's true. Cory yeah, got on yeah, rice yeah, tick. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you see me? She had the and slender shoulders. Says, yeah, man. Yeah. I never forget that. And Tessa threw the throw of her life, bro. Yeah, man. And she yeah. won the Olympic gold. And all Fatima Whitbread got was the bronze. <laughs> and if you remember now, Sanderson, because of that, I'll put it here. It says nobody gave her a chance. It was all about. Fatima Whitbread. Let me put up, see what I put on the back and then I put. What I loved about Tessa Sanderson, she wasn't your typical fair skinned, mm-hmm. slim. Mm. Yeah. You she, know, she was a back home girl, man. She, this is what I put, not the fair skinned type. Tessa looked like my girlfriends, girls I used to go to school with, <laughs> girls I used to run joke with. Yeah, yeah. As I says, bro, you know, bit flabby, not ugly. Mm. Might be carrying a bit of tin bag, but that's because of the diet at home, the chicken and rice and the mutton and rice and the ox style and the stupid yeah. and all those kind of things. You understand? That's why she was carrying a bit of tin bag, not because she was a greedy cow, but she's eating yeah. some good food, bro. <laughs> she's eating good because remember, you know, a, she's a Jamaican. She's a Jamaican. Remember? And if you remember, who did she bring through? My brother, Mr. Motivation. Hmm. Oh, Mr. Yeah, 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 Mr. Bartow. You understand yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. So, but for me as a hero growing up, mm. Tessa Sanderson, fam. Tessa Sanderson, because Tessa Sanderson made every black girl know we can do something, we can achieve. Oh, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. True, true, I, true, I true, 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 true. I don't have to look like um, a light skinned Cindy yeah, or yeah. a light skinned Barbie. Yeah. I have to have some pencil slim figure. No, I can have my little curvaceous and my big hips and the batty. Sorry, mm. my bumper. You understand? <laughs> um, she can, she can. <laughs> Getting excited, see the excitement, doctor. Yeah, yeah. Um, you understand? She yeah. didn't have to. That conventional look, what we thought growing up in the eighties, especially because mm. a lot of dark skinned women had complexes because of the way society pictured them. Because remember, remember the film School Days, the Jigaboos versus the wallabies. The wannabes were the fair-skinned black girls and the jigaboos were the dark-skinned black girls. Mm. And they had these two people, these two g- clashing mm. blacks versus blacks. You see, mm. that's how much they got us confused. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Come you on understand? And as I says, for me, Tessa Sanderson proved I don't have to look like the establishment what the establishment wants me to. I don't have to look like Sade. <laughs> you understand? Sade, I don't have to look like Sade. And I don't have to look manly like what Fatima Whitbread. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. as Tessa Sanderson was not an ugly woman. Yeah, 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 yeah. She's a, and she, she had the Jerry Curl at the time because you know the girls that had the Jerry Curl. Yeah, curl she went that Jerry Curls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think everything culminated in that Olympic. Because from then she just lived off that Olympic gold. She didn't do nothing after that. Yeah. And I don't think Whitbread ever. I think Whitbread only got a silver and she retired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? The And what hurt her the most was that she lost because. If I remember correctly, I think she was very racial mm. towards Tessa Sanderson. If I remember mm. correctly, she was very rude to her, disrespectful to her. Mm. That said, Fatima Whitbread. Mm. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. No, that's crazy. But listen, I'm going to go back to Marcus because Marcus did have somebody um, lined up. He kind of sneaked mm. in. He's like, he sneaked in one like you. Uh, like uh, 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 not only because like, Ant mentioned yeah, them, yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah, wasn't yeah, sure yeah. if going to bring them in next yeah, couple. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nah, William Sisters, and we sneaked in Kaepernick there and we, and, and, and we brought in Tessa Sanderson. But let's go back to Mark. Marcus, what are you saying, man? 